Hey guys, hope you had a great weekend. Just want to talk about Tesla for a second over here. We're discussing the December 4th, 2020 OPEX, which is for this coming Friday. Tesla closed at $585 approximately on Friday. And the options market is currently pricing in an upside move to 641. That's the upper expected move. The upper potential move is 665. The lower expected move is 529, and the lower potential move is 505. Now, given the Tesla's run up about 47% in the last couple of weeks due to the, the, the news that they're gonna be included in the S&P 500, I'm inclined to think that we're gonna see a pullback in the short term. Thus, I'm looking at bear put spreads for the weekly OPEX. And looking at these, you can see that if you go at the money, you can, you, can, you can buy an at the money put at the 580 strike and sell the 550 strike and your overall debit ends up being about $13.30 or so and your maximum profit would then be $17 approximately, right? So you have, you have um, just, a, just over a 1.5 times risk reward or so, or no, it, it's, it's a little bit less than that, but it's, it's about uh, 1.3 times uh, reward per unit of risk, right? Uh, if you want, if you want to be a little bit more cavalier and go out of the money, you can do so as well. But keep in mind, due to the high IV premiums, your uh, probability of profit will be diminished unless we get a drastic pullback. So by that I mean looking, for example, at the um, lower expected move target, which is around 5:30 for the week. You can see if we buy the 5:50 strike and we sell the 5:30 strike. At that point, you incur a debit of about 550, and your maximum upside will be about four, uh, $14.50. So you have about a three to one risk reward over here. This is probably a better strategy, especially if you have a smaller account because you're risking less than the premium over here, but keep in mind, it is a short duration trade and does have high risk, right? I'm just giving you some ideas on how to possibly trade it based upon my thesis that we're gonna see a nice pullback on Tesla in the short term. Obviously, you do your own research and manage your own risk accordingly. But um, yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments below and have a great evening.